Hello everyone, Neon Jigglypuff here, and welcome to another episode of the Nostalgia series. I know, this is a very long overdue episode, and sorry, I'm actually editing audio right now, live, as we speak. But, welcome guys, we're back in the Nostalgia series, and today we're going to be playing the magic... Okay, uh, the cutscene's playing now. Okay, come on, Mickey Mouse with their creepy, like, hollow eyes. I don't know why they did that, but... Yes, we are playing Disney's Magical Mirror starring Mickey Mouse, or as I called it as a kid, Mickey Mouse Mirrors, because it was simple and easy to say. Normal kids? We're gonna go normal because we're not a kid anymore, but, um, yeah, this game is, uh, wait, I won't, wait, do I still have my, okay, no, so my save data's gone, I guess, I, I guess I had a, I had a different uh, memory card back then, but anyway, this is a very, very nostalgic game for me. I didn't have it for long, so like I played this game a lot as a kid, but then uh, the disc, I'm pretty sure it got scratched and it broke, because, you know, a kid, as a kid I wasn't that good at taking care of my games, because I never kept the cases, I just kept the discs out. I know, it was horrible, but I learned, I learned my lesson. But today, we're gonna be playing it again, because recently I went to an anime convention called Anime North, and uh, they had it there. So I'm like, hey, it's really cheap, I'll buy it and do a video for it, and uh, here we are, we're back, and I'm playing this game, and it's it's gonna be a wild ride. I think I'm gonna enjoy this again, because it's been a long time, like, I mean, a long time since I played this, and uh, yeah, let's not drag on for any longer, let's start a new game, and as usual, while I play this, I will be telling stories about my experience with these games and memories and stuff. Because, like, this cutscene right here, it's already bringing back memories. And, like, I'm already kind of like, oh, Like, the Mickey Mouse model was always, like, weird. Because, like, his eyes. But I'm just like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. This cutscene. Hold on. I should say quiet for cutscenes. But, you know. I think another Mickey Mouse comes out of the mirror, I believe. Right? Is that what happens? Okay. I'm sorry to talk over cutscenes. I, I usually don't do this, but like, it's nostalgia series, you know? It's not a let's play. The story's not that crazy. Oh yeah, this thing! I remember him! Oh! His soul leaves his butt. Wait, I remember it, but I don't at the same time. Okay. This is... Oh my god, it's all coming back to me now. I remember this! Why did his soul leave his body, though? I don't remember. I, I remember, but I don't at the same time. Like, so an evil ghost tells him. Wait, what? Why did Mickey Mouse? Okay, I remember this now. Okay, why did Mickey Mouse's soul? And why did we just see Mickey Mouse's ass? I, that's one of the many things I remember, is that it ended with us seeing his ass. Yeah. Okay, I... Wow! Okay, this is exactly how I remember. There's a room with three doors. Very nostalgic. Wow, the music and the worlds and the... His model looks so weird. I love this. I, it, it, it's charming. I like this. Here we go, and... Oh, yeah! Go, yeah, I forgot. That was like, yeah, and then he acts all confused, and then, yeah, that was like, amazing. Hmm. hmm, I wonder where we go! Uh, yeah, we have to- wait, what? Why is it making me go through the other door? I don't remember this part. I remember, um, having to go here, though. Okay, Mickey. Are you gonna figure it out yet? Mickey? Are you good? Wait a minute. Oh! Oh! Oh yeah, there was like another Mickey who would cause mischief, I think. There was like an evil Mickey or something. His reflection? Even though his soul left his body, just that... He's gonna kick him, isn't he? Yep, there he is, he kicks him. There's like an evil Mickey or something. Okay, this is... This is actually kind of charming. I know it's very childish, obviously, but I remember this, and it's... Oh! This is a whole thing, then, okay. Stop right there! Oh, there's voice acting in this game? Well, I guess while this is happening, I, I guess I can talk about some stories now, because- Ooh! Oh yeah, that's our collectible! We don't have to- Okay. Hold on, there's a cutscene going. I know there's no voice acting, but like, I want to take all this in before I start getting into like, stories and stuff like that. Hmm. So I guess this is our collectible, from what I remember. Okay. I think we have to collect like- 
I don't know, I think it's like five of them. Or no, there's multiple items. I, I remember once we found a bow for Minnie Mouse. So there are multiple collectibles in this, and it's not just stars. And there's also like mini, like I think there's a rhythm game too. Okay. Oh, go! Oh, this song too. This song is so nostalgic. Oh, it's like. Wait, what? Wait, what? This is like Mario 64. We collect stars and open up doors, and what is happening now? So this game is more like a cartoon than a game. It's just like an interactive. Co oh. Okay, that guy has our key. I don't know if this guy is our villain or our hero because he's giving us the stuff that we nice. need, but he's also... That's not nice! Oh, the voice acting is so cheesy in this game, but I, it, I love it. Yeah, there we go. He holds it up like a Zelda character, and yeah, there we go. And the room is all dimmed. Okay. Oh, this is all coming back to me! I love this! Oh, this is getting me excited now. Okay, so I guess now that we're actually getting into the gameplay now... I, I, you know, the light gameplay. Um, let's talk about the stories with this game. Mm -hmm. and Mickey? Okay. So, um, this is a game that my mom and I used to play a lot. And it was more so, like, my mom playing and me watching. And sometimes we would just take turns. Like, I would play and she would watch. And if I got stuck, she would help me. But, oh my god, he's watching himself sleep. That's kind of creepy. This is like, he's like lucid dreaming right now. He's, he's actually lucid dreaming right now. Okay, but anyway, um, my mom and I would always play this game together. Like, this was like our game. This is the one game we'd always play together. Because like, in my family, it was always me and a family member who would always play a game together. Like, for example, my cousin and I would play Sunshine together. My aunt and I would play Donkey Kong 64. And my mom and I would play this. This, this was our game. So... Yeah, it's very, very nostalgic, and um, it brings back a lot of memories. I remember, I think I was only in kindergarten when I got this game, because this game came out in 2002, as it said in the in the what? title. So I was probably only about two or three years old when I got this game, and we played it a lot. I'm like, I don't think we ever beat it, I think. I don't remember for sure, but we did play a lot of it. And I remember there actually is one... What? Oh, oh, that's the story. Yeah, we have to get back to the mirror pieces. He breaks it. Yeah, there we go. He breaks it, and then we can't get back to our body. So I remember there's a few cutscenes where, like, there's a bee, and he has to try not to get stung. And then there's also, like, a mini game where you do a rhythm thing with the classic Mickey Mouse. Like, the monochrome one, and that was actually really, really wow. cool. Hmm? So, um... Yeah, I, so now Mickey Mouse is stuck in this weird mirror house and he has to try and get out. Let's examine. And we, you know, we discover puzzles by examining certain objects and, um. Wait, what? Is he about to get attacked? What? Yeah, I'm, I'm. This is the same reaction, Mickey. Um, what? So weird, I have a friend, I call her Mickey too, and it's not like spelt like Mickey Mouse, it's just M-I-M-I-C-K-Y, there's no E in there. Oh my god, this is bringing back so many memories, like I remember also, I had a Mickey Mouse plush that I used to protect, like I used to, this is back when, it's okay, so I'm gonna sound old, because back, you know, back in my day, because you know, back when I was a kid, they didn't have any Mario toys, and if they did, they were they were very like uncommon. You wouldn't see them in like toy stores. You'd have to go online and order them, or like get them from a claw machine in like Japan or something, right? Or an arcade. It was not easy to find. So I always wanted like you know Mario toys, right? But I could never get them. So what I did was okay. If you're wondering why that scene just got skipped, um, I just saw something huge and disgusting crawling on my desk. It was a bug. I hated it. I hate it. I hate everything about it. There was a- I was trying to tell a story. oh my god. I was just trying to tell a story about my childhood and something huge and disgusting just crawled on my desk. And I don't know what it was, but, uh, it's gone now. Um, but yeah, I don't even remember what I was saying now. I forgot what I was saying. Oh yeah, I forgot the Mario toy things. Okay, so, um, yeah, back then we didn't have Mario toys. Like, there weren't- they were like, you know, uncommon. You didn't see them anywhere, right? 
So um, what I did was I took toys I already had and I pretended they were Mario characters. So, like say for example, Mickey Mouse was Mario. I had a Bob the Builder that was Luigi. I, I had the eight playable characters in Mario Party three and four and I used them as certain characters. So for example, yeah, um, Mickey Mouse was Mario. Bob the Builder was Luigi. Mm -hmm. Minnie Mouse was Peach, uh, Wendy from Bob the Builder was Daisy, I had a little Franklin toy that I, I used to pretend was Yoshi, I had a monkey that, like, a, a little monkey plush that I pretended that was Donkey Kong, I had Shrek, which I, pre yeah, I had, I had a Shrek toy that I pretended was, um, Wario, and then I had the Hulk, which I pretended was Waluigi because he was tall and skinny and thin. What the hell? Okay, I have to get that glass piece. Okay, there we go. There we go. Oh, that was fast. Okay. So, um, yeah, I had a bunch of toys that I pretended that were Mario characters, and it was very, um... I don't know if you call it sad. I wouldn't call it sad. I would just call it, you know, me... Y younger me having a big imagination, pretending that all these characters are Mario characters. I even had, like... A smaller monkey, which I pretended wasn't, it wasn't uh, Diddy Kong, it was actually Toad. And then I had Bubbles from Powerpuff Girls, which I, pre I pretended was Toadette because of the pigtails and the little dress. It, w it was a lot. There was also a pink elephant, which I pretended was Birdo. And I can go on and on about this, but this is not about, you know, me pretending that my toys were Mario characters as a kid. This is about this game, Mickey Mouse Mirrors, and... Oh, what? That went on for a long time. But anyway, um... Yeah, this game, my mom and I would play a lot. And uh, it was like, it was just our game. It was our thing, you know? We'd always play... I saw that thing moving. We'd play this game all the time, and like, it was fun! Because like, it was like, my mom and I were on an adventure looking for secrets in this, like, mirror house, and it was a lot of fun. Like, I really, really enjoyed it, you know? It's quality time with m Oh my god, this song. Oh my god, I remember this. <gasps> Another glass piece! If, what, I, what I can remember, this game is actually very short. Why can't I- Um, are you gonna come closer, lad? La I just said lad. I'm all oh, bro from Kite Bay, bro. Okay, so Mickey doesn't want to go over there. This game was like, it was like an adventure that my mom and I would go on, finding puzzles, you know, getting the glass shards for the mirror. It was a lot of fun, you know. It was just like it, it's stuff that like you obviously can't do today because like you know we're busy, we're adults now. But it was quality time with my mom, and it was fun to play this game with her. And yeah, I, I wouldn't mind going back in time and playing this, but here we are, we're playing this game alone. I'm actually, I'm not playing alone, I'm playing with you guys, actually, you know? This is us! Uh, oh, oh, okay. Okay, that's cool, the puzzles are pretty- Ooh. That is freaking terrifying. Trick. Oh yeah, it goes all negative! So something's gonna happen then. Okay, so every time we do a trick, something happens to Mickey. Oh, whoa, 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 I have to... Okay, we have to trick Mickey. Are you kidding me? I missed something. I, I screwed up. The key's up there. Are you... I messed it up. Did I... Oh, there we go, there we go, there we go, get it, get it! Mickey, what are you, what the fuck are you doing? Okay, you know it's bad when I, I don't know how to play baby games. Wow, I can't figure this game out now. How? He was, we looked right at the, he looked right at the key and he didn't do anything. It, what? Okay. Okay. That's a Donald Duck ghost. Oh. Gotcha. Um... Why is it? There's something. Oh, there's a star behind there. There's a, there's a star. Okay, wait. I know we can watch the TV. I think we can actually watch old Mickey Mouse skits. I believe, or the, maybe the recreations in the old Mickey Mouse art style. Okay, so we got another star. 
And that fills our gauge. Okay, there we go. We can get that key now. Maybe we had to do that then. Oh, I'm missing an item. Wow, mm -hmm. it's being really obvious and I'm still... I still can't figure it out. Okay, let's go over here then. There's a, the door's broken. Oh, there's stars over here. Wait, let's not waste them actually. Let's not waste those stars. You know what? We have Our star gauge is full. Let's go and get that key now. I have two stars! I have two stars! I have two stars! What is it telling? I literally have- Bro! I have two stars! <gasps> Trick! Hell yeah! Okay, we did it! Okay, I'm good at baby games! I can beat baby games! Oh! Oh! Okay, they're back! Good! Okay, wait, why didn't they come back the second time? It's a puzzle game. I mean, no shit, it's a puzzle game, but you know, this is a, this is fun. Please don't waste those stars. For the love of God, Mickey, do not. Oh, oh, every time it does that, it's a trick. Okay, we can, okay. This is a puzzle. What? Something's gonna happen to, wait, oh, what the fuck? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I was right. There actually was something, something that made us small. I, like, I I remember being small. Wait a minute. When I said this is Kingdom Hearts 2, maybe I'm just remembering it wrong. Maybe I'm just remembering it. Wait, no, 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 get those stars. Wait, no, do not get those stars. There's a lot here. Please don't go there. Mickey, I swear to God. Okay, here we go. Oh, the music's cute now. Or, or, no, it's not. Okay, but maybe when I said this is, this is like Kingdom Hearts 2, maybe I'm just remembering. Oh. Golly. Golly. Maybe I'm rem I can't talk. Maybe mm -hmm. I'm remembering it wrong. Maybe I'm remembering this game. Uh oh. Did he just steal that money? Oh. Oh, trick, 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 trick. Oh, shit. I could have. Okay, maybe I am. Okay, I'm remembering it. I cannot talk. I'm remembering it wrong. We could have got the... I guess I was remembering this game and not Kingdom Hearts. Wait, wait is there even a, a point in Kingdom Hearts 2 where you're, like, on a miniature cho like toy train? Is that even... Like, I know there's a train in the game, obviously, but, like... Is there even a point in that game where you're in a miniature... I cannot speak. A miniature toy train? Probably not. I just realized he's a mouse going through a mouse hole. If we could have any non-video game character in Smash Brothers, it would probably be either... It'd be a Disney character for sure. Mickey Mouse or wreck -It Where are you going, buddy? Mm -hmm. You know, he's an icon. Look at Mickey Mouse. He's literally an icon. He would fit right in with Mario and Pac-Man and stuff like that, right? And also, Ralph, because he's in a movie about video games. So it's like he's kind of fitting as well since he's literally met... A bunch of characters in Smash Bros, like Bowser and Ryu and Ken. And you know who wouldn't be in Smash though? Goku, because you know Goku's pretty much just Japanese anime Spider-Man. I mean Spider-Man, Superman. So it's like, you know, if you were gonna have anyone, it'd be Superman over Spider. You see, I don't even I don't remember his name, so it's like, you know. Um Wait, this thing's gonna follow us, isn't it? This thing's alive. I think this thing's alive, or it's following us. Huh? I think it's gonna chase us, yeah. I think this is gonna chase us. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh, it, it, it's possessed by the, by the ghost thing. Oh my god, I remember this game being so sinister. This is so sinister for a, like a, a Mickey Mouse game. I don't remember having nightmares about this, but it, this is probably something I'd be scared of, honestly. Like, I, as a kid, a lot of things would scare me. That probably scared me as a kid. Trick, 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 trick! Yes! Oh my god, we gotta react. I like this! Oh my god, there's, there's actual gameplay in this! Oh my god! I love this game now! 
I love it even more than I did before! Hmm? Oh my god, this is fun. Got it! Wow. Oh! Hmm? Wow. This is actually terrifying. Trick! 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 A three! I need three stars. I don't I only have one. I can't do anything about it. Oh fuck. Mickey, you're gonna die. I'm sorry. I don't have any stars. Wow, that duck tried mm -hmm. this fucking duck. Oh. Yeah, if a, a, a rocking horse just starts moving on its own, first instinct is the. <gasps> yeah, there's a shard. There we go. We got a shard. This is like what our third one. There we go. Cool. We got shard number three, or is it four? I don't know. I don't remember. But I'm unironically enjoying this. But anyway, um, I had a Mickey Mouse plush that I would like. It was like my favorite toy as a kid. I'd bring it everywhere. I I don't know if I still have it anymore, unfortunately, but I had it for a long time. And it was like my absolute favorite thing. I would bring it everywhere. Like I'd bring it, actually I wouldn't bring it to school because the school had a strict rule about toys from home. It's like if you brought a toy from home, they would they would uh, confiscate it for the day and, and return it to you at the end of the day. Cause like, and as a kid, I was like, oh, this is so stupid. What a dumb rule. But now I'm like, I, I, I understand why. Because it's like someone could have stolen it. And then like, you know, I would have been pissed off if someone stole my Mickey Mouse toy. I would have killed. I'm not really killed, obviously. But I would have, I would have probably punched someone. I was not a good kid. I can tell you that. Also, guys, I'm really enjoying this, by the way. So like, if you're enjoying this kind of game too, I don't know why you guys would enjoy it unless like it was your childhood game too. So like I, I, I can understand if not a lot of people watch this video, but it's like I'm doing it because it's my nostalgia and I want to share it with you guys. Like I want to share my childhood with you guys. That's why I do this series in the first place It's because I'm sharing my childhood and there's going to be more too. It's in fact, there's going to be another nostalgia series video coming out fairly soon. Oh, the TV's plugged in. We can, yeah, we can watch the Mickey Mouse skits i think hmm. or what so yeah if you guys are enjoying this too uh, don't forget to leave a like because I, i'm sorry i have to do this i have to i have to tell people to leave a like mid video which i'm sorry i hate to do but you know at this point youtube kind of like demands it at this point so it's like you know i'm sorry to be that guy to ask for likes mid video but i'm gonna have to do it you know if you guys are enjoying the video leave a like and you know comment telling me if you um, grew up with this game, or how about you tell me a game that you grew up with too, and um, yeah. And, as I said a million times, I, I, keep, I keep repeating myself. Why do I keep repeating myself in videos, you know? I'm gonna do it again though, because I'm, I'm an idiot. But if you guys want to see another part, I'll do a part two, but that's all I'm gonna say now. I'm done, and I promise, I'll stop repeating myself in videos and streams. I do that way too much. Piggy. There's something in there. Is it a star? Or wait, it's a shard, isn't it? Is there a trick? Mm, it's a this is a tricky one. This is a tricky one. So smash it. Mm. Oh, I see. I see what we have to do. Okay. Okay, this game is clever. I like this. I know what we have to do. I will skip ahead to what we have to do. I had the right idea. I had the right idea the whole time. I'll be right back, guys. Okay. okay. We need that. Okay, we did it. Okay, there we go. We got the money. Oh, perfect. We can, we can skip the cutscene, though, right? No, we can't. I'll see you after. What? Why was that so sinister? I'm sorry. Why? Why is everything out to kill Mickey Mouse? I swear, this is like every RPG ever. A fake treasure chest. Trick again? Okay, trick. Everything is out to kill him. Ooh. Oh, this, oh my god, it's the Matrix. Where'd that cliche come from again? Was it actually the. Oh. Oh. We got another star. Okay, we got another star. Cool. This feels like a real game. I know it is a real game, but it's like... I didn't expect it to be this, like... In de I don't remember it being this, like... 
in depth. You know, for for a baby game that is. I don't remember it being this like much of a game. This is it's impressive. This game, like the fact that me, like at almost 20 years old, can still find enjoyment out of this game, either says I'm really, really childish and I'm easily entertained, or um. Capcom was doing something right with this game. All right, and now we're back here. We can do the trick and we can ride the plane, I assume. What? Oh God, he actually froze. This is the Matrix. He's like freezing time or like slowing it down. What? Okay, this is, wow, this is literally the Matrix. Oh my God, there was a piece of, oh, we have to, oh God, we gotta do, oh. We almost got killed, look at that. Why is this duck trying to kill us? He looks like Cuphead, like th that, like the, the, like, angry expression with the teeth smile, like, that was, like, Cuphead. We have to shoot him down. No, we are not. Uh, we're shooting him! We just killed- oh my god, that's Cuphead! Look at him! Oh my god. Okay, okay, I unironically want Mickey Mouse and Smash Brothers now. Unironically? Okay, yeah, but seriously, though, I knew it was a ghost, but still, I- Can we get Mickey Mouse for Smash? This is the best Mickey Mouse game. No, the best Disney- what? Are we Mario 64 now? Excuse me? Hmm? What? This is game- hmm. this game's actually cool. We're Mario 64 now. This is the boss ba- <laughs> What? Oh, they're in- oh, they're inverted controls! Oh no! Oh no, I don't like this. I don't like this. They're inverted controls. I don't like this for like... I don't like when games control like this. I'm being honest. It's... I missed the... Wait, no, I didn't miss the star. Oh God! Okay, um... Increase speed. Collect stars to increase your time limit. Shoot the bubbles! I'll just- I'm just gonna- This is literally Cuphead! Look at this! You cannot tell me that we're not playing Cuphead right now. If Cuphead ever had, like, a 3D, like, sequel, it would be like this. Actually, no, I hope not, because it should- Oh my god, imagine a 3D Cuphead game. You know how difficult that- That would be even more difficult. Maybe. Actually, no, would, would making a game like that 3D- Would making a game 3D actually make it easier, or would it make it harder? Oh, we're killing it! Oh, we're killing you! You're, you're dying! Oh, he looks terrifying right now. Come on, come on, we got, we got this! We got this! We got this! Yeah, come on! No, don't go into the bubble! He looks horrifying right now! But this is actually cool! Oh, there we go. Just one little, little pellet is all it takes. What? I didn't get full! Okay, fine. I'll take it. Oh, cool, but we got our, our gauge is full up. This, our gauge is full up. Okay. This game is really cool. Oh my god, I love that. I love that, like, Posey does. Alright, so I think I'm gonna call the game here. I, um... I can't save right now, but... I think I'm gonna end the episode off here. It was a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoyed. Because I know I did, and, um, you know, as usual... Um, you know, uh, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, favorite, and comment. Um, what? I haven't done comment of the day in so long. How about this? Uh, what was your... Did, I know, did, did you grow up with this game? Like, did you have this game growing up? And if you didn't, tell me about a game you had, like, what is a game you and your mom, or like, you and your dad, or whoever, like, you and, like, a parent or guardian grew up playing together, you know? Like, what was your thing? Because my thing with my mom was playing this game. That was like, we'd always do this together. It was a lot of fun. So what was your kind of like, you know, parent bonding thing, you know? Uh, I, I want to know. So yeah, with that all said, I hope you all have a great day and I will see you in the next episode where we either play this again, if you guys want it, I'll do a part two of this video. And if not, we're going to be playing a different game, a nostalgic game and um, well, yeah. So I'll see you guys later and don't forget, so have a great day. See you later, guys.